Our other top story tonight, a carjacking in broad daylight caught on camera, and it's how these guys pulled it off that makes it even scarier. Sean Lay following this for us, and he comes to us now live. Sean, pretty clear this group had this uh, planned out well in advance. It was an ambush right here in Hamtramck, right near this very busy and popular park. Follow me this way. Danforth and Joseph Campo, you had two vehicles here watching a house, keeping an eye on it. When the victim left the house and went to go get in his car, that's when these guys made their terrifying move. What you're about to see is chilling. Five o'clock this past Saturday on Danforth at Joseph Combo in Hamtramck, a carjacking in broad daylight. A gunman sneaks out of that white Jeep and sneaks up on the young driver of a dark red Dodge Charger Hellcat. He sticks a gun in that kid's face and steals his hard earned car. The video shows you that this was all a setup. A white SUV at the top of your screen was likely watching for the victim to get into his car. And then the Jeep is called in to stalk that driver and then make their terrifying move. We showed the video to Angela Bassett, who lives on this street. Oh, yeah, I know that car. She sees the flashy red car and its driver every day. Oh, my God. That's, that's sad. That's sad. That's, I mean, the kid works. I know that for a fact, you know, he doesn't bother anybody. The victim's uncle tells us his nephew worked hard for his dream car, only to have a team of carjackers watch him, wait for him, and take his car at gunpoint. Back here live, Hamtramck police just getting a look at that video today. They say it is a big time clue to their investigation. Devin, back to you. Well, Sean, at times like this, they start looking uh, around to see if there have been any other carjackings that might sort right. of match this scenario. Are they finding anything like that? Yeah, there's been three in Hamtramck, but just in 2018 alone, the chief here says they're not related. However, people are getting a look at that video. One woman already saying that she recognizes the gunman uh, who stole her car as well. So this may be expanding a bit. All right, Sean.